Hey guys, it is April 1st today. Happy April Fool's Day to those of you who actually do pranks and stuff. I hope they went well. I don't generally do April Fool's Day pranks generally just because I can never actually think of anything to do. Today I'm going to talk about the Hunger Games a little bit. I, I promise I won't give any spoilers or anything. It's going to be short. I just wanted to say I have got a lot of the nail polish already. Yeah, I should not be spending this much on nail polish, but I have got a whole bunch of the, I think I have almost half of the Hunger Games nail polishes, just because that's how addicted I guess I am to the whole series and everything. Um, I saw the movie with my aunt and two of my cousins, and I really liked the movie. Uh, I know some people didn't like it who read the book, some people really liked it who read the book, I read the book and I liked it. I, I enjoyed it. Of course, like, there's things that were different um, compared to the book and the movie, but overall I think it was really well done. It was not another Twilight, thank God, in my opinion. So, we don't have to worry about that. Yes. So, this is mainly for the girls. Because, guys, you probably won't want to paint your nails. So you probably won't really care. But I'm going to show you guys all the Hunger Games nail polishes I have gotten so far. I have this one on my nails right now actually. This one is called Harvest Moon. And I think it's for District 9, which is Grain, which even though I've read the books, I totally like didn't even know that District 10 was Grain. There was a couple different districts where I was kind of like, what? Seriously? That's what it does? Because I had no idea. Got Stone Cold, which is actually really cool. I have this on my toes right now. It's um, it's like a really matty finish, and it actually makes your nails kind of look like stone. And it's from District 2, which is apparently masonry. This one is, it's kind of hard to tell just because of the light or whatever, but it's like a really orange color. Uh, this is District 3, so it's like electric stuff. And it's called Riveting. Yes, riveting. There is District 12, obviously, which is called Smoke and Ashes, which I haven't tried yet. Um, but from the pictures I've seen, like on the internet and stuff, it seems like it'd be a pretty cool color. It's just black and sparkly. Hello, I'm doing my vlog. Can you let me finish this? Some of these are probably over. Thank you. The rest are probably Ellie's. Yep. I will give them to her. And the last one is Electrify, and it's one of those like sparkly ones that you can't actually really put on your nails without like putting some sort of color on underneath. But anyway, it's like red and gold sparkly colors. And it's District 5, which is power. Again, like, what? So many of these districts, I realized, I don't know if this makes me a really bad fan or what, but I didn't know what like half of the districts were supposed to mean. Like, three, five, um, two even. Like, I, I know one is, like, luxury or whatever. And then I know three and four, I think. Four, I think four is the fishing. I don't know. I know there's a fishing one. I know there's, like, a trees one. Um, I know there's the agriculture and the mining and power now and like masonry now which I think is like six of them so really I don't even know that many of them which is maybe I just need to reread the books I don't know I don't have time though because we only have four days left of school do you like we have four days left of school you guys and it's only April how like I don't know if this is kind of crazy to anybody else but this feels really weird to me like the fact that I'm gonna be done school before competition starts for dance is just kind of blowing my mind a little bit and it kind of makes me sad because I used to like missing school for dance and now I can't anymore not that missing university would really be a good thing either way I'm gonna be done now and I hope you guys had a good first day of April and you had a more exciting day than I did because my day was kind of lame but that's all and I will see you guys next week in theory, because it's Easter, I don't really know what's going on for me, if I'll be doing a vlog because it's a holiday. But, assuming I do, I'll see you guys next week. 
and I hope you guys have a good Easter because I probably won't talk to you or see you vlog wise before then. So, see you guys.